All right, when we want to solve for this, first thing we're going to do is move the 1 half to the right side. We're going to complete the square. It's a little bit different. So we're going to have 3. I'm going to factor out of 3. So we get x squared plus 1 third x. And then this is equal to 1 half. And then what I'm going to do is 1 half of this, um, which is 1 6, so plus 1 over 36. So 1 half of that, so 1 over 30, one, 1 over 6. That squared is 1 over 36, then multiply times 3. So I get 3 over 36, which is equal to 1 over 12. This plus. So I get 3 times x plus 1 over 6 squared is equal to uh, 7 over 12, because um, this is 6 over 12 plus 1 over 12. I'm going to divide 3 by 3. This times 1 third. So x plus 1 sixth. Um, well, it's because I'm going to take square root. Uh, I'm just going to write it again. Seven over thirty-six. Square root of both sides. Um, go over here. I get x plus one sixth. Uh, is equal to plus or minus square root of 7 over 6. Subtract 1 sixth from both sides, and I end up finally with x is equal to um, negative 1 or either way. Well, I'll just write it like this. Shoot. Negative or plus or minus the square root of 7 minus 1. And you can do that because they both have a common denominator of 6. So you can write either negative 1 plus or minus square root of 7 or over 6 or plus or minus square root of 7 minus 1 over 6. Either way is correct. All right, that's the solution. Hope that works for you.